and we're back. I kind of cut out like 80% of this dungeon because it got pretty long. Um, also, I only died three more times. So that's an improvement, I guess. Spell things correctly, please. What? That canoe is, like, half the size of my head. How are all four of us inside it? Can't you find a freaking canoe grab it with a person in it? Four people in it, rather. Breaking the bridge there, that was... Even if it was on purpose, that was kind of dumb looking. Why does it stop every time they talk and every time you get to a waterfall? It shouldn't stop. Also, it should actually pass under the bridges instead of just becoming invisible when it gets near them. Also, it appears to be under the waterfall right now. This whole sequence is just rather poorly done. It should speed up as it goes over the waterfall. It shouldn't get to the waterfall, stop, jump over, stop, and then go again. That's not how motion works. And the text boxes should not stop the movement either. These aren't hard things to do. I know how to do them in RPG Maker 95. Finally, a fucking inn! Oh my god, why wasn't there an inn at the beginning? Why didn't the priests at the beginning heal? That would make this whole thing, like, actually bearable. If you're... The fact that there wasn't an inn at the beginning made me assume your game doesn't have inns, because that's the only possible excuse for there not being one. Alright, I think I'm probably at the end of the dungeon here, because I just opened a treasure chest that said, Roxaline got one of every e one of every healing item. This gave him a feeling of unease for some reason. And then I talked to a monster, and the monster said, I'm a healer, not a fighter. And fully healed me. And now here's a statue of the boy god, and a bunch of NPCs down there are talking about it. So I'm pretty sure I'm about to fight a boss. <laughs> Hopefully I'm not going to fight the boy god. But I almost certainly am, because that's how it works. Um, what? Those cliffs just kind of end. Shouldn't they keep going down? Um, the, is this whole place floating in midair? I thought we were on a mountain, not a floating continent. photo? Wait, so he created the world, but there's a photo of him with his parents. I beg your pardon? Still fresh. the holy trash can. This is great. 
Here's a map. Weird. So is it supernaturally clean, or does someone live here? I want to take it. That would be really good equipment. Really? Monsters don't usually attack people? Isn't that the definition of a monster? You spelled through wrong? His name is Exclamation Point? Maybe that's supposed to be a question mark? What was that noise? Treasure chest? Yoshi's Island music playing here. These guys are like Team Rocket, except they're all James. Kids got sass. Okay. We'll actually use Tattle this time, I guess. I probably should have used that buggy buffing spell that you can only use outside of battle because Priam's AI is too retarded to use it during battle. Um, oh, also I found out you can use your damage spells outside of battle. And they don't do anything, obviously, but they still cost you MP. 
so that's got to be a bug. Oh, yeah, thanks. He doesn't even... Man. I don't know why I don't have control of these people. That would make this whole thing bearable, almost. Well, no. That and, like, five other changes would make it bearable, but that would go a long way. I didn't know he had a cool zeppelin. There's literally nothing I can do in this battle to change its outcome so far. Because my two people who have spells that are possibly useful, I can't control. Every single one of Roxolini's moves does exactly the same thing. So that magic does a lot less damage than usual. I guess it's because of the spirit down. I wouldn't expect spirit to affect damage. I would expect it to affect healing and possibly status effects and possibly magic defense. Okay, so I can actually do something. I can choose who to use cherries on. Nope, not anymore. He just killed me from full health. That's awesome. Absolutely awesome. That you were supposed to lose that? The hell? I wasted like ten cherries on that. I hate that. That is that's the worst. Why did you let me use all my items up? Vampiric flying machine? No, I'm picturing a zeppelin with fangs. And a giant cape. Why does that actually sound really awesome looking? That's the most disturbing picture I've seen today. Okay. Guess that's the end of the demo, though. So it didn't matter that I used up my cherries. Um, guess that's the end of Let's Try Alinlia. Uh, Robotnik in a bikini is my reward for having beaten this demo.